to Do Anilling DS Diva. My name is Amber, and today we're going to talk about my week 18 update. So, as you can tell, I don't have the lace front wig in today. I took out the Dutch braids that were in there, and I love the way the hair looks after you take out Dutch braids or French braids. But I took those out and I decided to cut my hair shorter, so it was probably about there just so that it's easier to stick under the wig and kind of conceal everything and easier to maintain with the hair loss and everything. Do have another scary picture of me washing and brushing out my hair again, which I will grace you with. Um, for my week 18 update, I am now at 254.9 pounds, so I lost 2.8 pounds this week. So a little bit less than I've been trending, but I also got my period last week in between everything that was going on, so I was actually surprised that I even lost 2.8 pounds because the last couple times I've had my period, it's kind of been a stall for me. So. Things are going good. Have not applied the wig myself yet, but now that I have it cut, I'm probably gonna do that real soon and see how that goes. Um, hopefully, I'm decent-ish at it. I did get it from a place in Ogden called Shop Hair Therapy. I don't know if I mentioned that in my last video, I can't remember. But they do work with insurance, so if there's like a medical reason that you have for needing a wig, for having hair loss, um, you can actually get a prescription from your doctor and go in and they will help hook you up through your insurance, which is really amazing. So I paid like $100 for the wig that I got and it's a long wig too so it's like a $300 wig and um yeah so I'm really excited so I got the prescription from my doctor for a cranial prosthetic and I just need to send that into the store and then once I do that I will be able to grab a bunch more to show you guys because I'm starting my wig wardrobe so that'll be super fun I'm thinking I want to get one that's easy to throw on too, that's not lace front, that has like bangs or something to conceal not having the lace so I can just throw it on and go if I need to. Um, I also think pink is cute and gray is cute. Let me know what you think. What hairstyles should I look at? So that's going to be a really fun thing for me. I do like having my natural hair this short. It is nice because, as I said, I have like a sensitive scalp. So it doesn't get as tangled as much. And I don't know, with losing hair, how long this is going to last and how bad it's going to get. So we'll have to see how that goes. So there is also this store that is close to by me or they're manufactured close by me the built bars it's a protein bar that I've heard really good stuff about and they're supposed to be super yummy so I definitely want to give those a shot and try them because I'm super curious and anything that can help up my protein game and not be awful like chewing protein powder I am down with so to hopefully try those pretty soon and let you know what I think about those. If you guys have any protein like additive things that you eat that you like, please let me know because I would love to try them because yeah, some of them aren't so great. Still working from home. Um, I don't know for sure what's going to come of that, but I did hear some rumors that some of us may be able to continue working from home because it does help with continuity. Like for example, if there's a really bad storm and people can't make it into work, I just 
roll out of bed and I'm there. So that's cool. I think I might like that because I live so far from my job that I commute two to three hours to my work. Well, not to my work, but to and from. It's quicker to get to work early in the morning than it is to drive home in rush hour traffic. So I'm not a huge fan of that. So hopefully I will be able to make working from home permanent because I like it. So if you guys have any questions for me, anything that you would like to know, please let me know so we can talk about that in a future video. Um, I'm going grocery shopping with my husband tonight, so I'm excited to get out again. Uh, I know that's super lame, but that's where I am in my life right now. Uh, I'm hoping that everything with the world kind of shifts more back to normal. I really want to go camping this year. I love camping and I want to just get out and do a bunch of stuff and I'm ready to go back to the gym. I want to go back to the gym so bad and my husband's like super anti going to the gym right now because it's so dangerous. So I used to do aqua zumba on Tuesdays and Thursdays and I love it. I love aqua zumba. So I would love to get back to doing that again and then I want to lift weights too which is kind of hard to do here at home. Um, I did, if you can see it back in that corner, I did get my exercise bike, so I can start pedaling on that. So that's nice, um, but I just, I'm ready to get back to normal, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, that's it for me, guys. I will hit you guys up in my next video. Bye.